Now, after an assassination attempt on former U.S. President Donald Trump in a rally in Pennsylvania, a lot has changed. The race to the White House, which was so far neck to neck between Donald Trump and Joe Biden, the incumbent president, now seems to be tilting in favor of Donald Trump. Here's more. Between July 13th and July 18th, at least 10 polls showed Trump with a durable lead. If you look at the poll conducted by YouGov, in collaboration with CBS News, Donald Trump holds a 5% lead over President Joe Biden. 47% of the registered voters preferred Biden, with 52% preferred Trump in the 2024 presidential race. SoCal Research gave Trump a 6% lead over Biden and Biden got the support of 45% respondents as against 51% of Trump. Now, RMG Research showed Biden at 46% and Trump at 51%. Morning Consult showed a four-point difference with Biden at 42% and Trump at 46%. Now, Emerson College gave Trump a 6% lead. As per the poll, Biden has the choice of 38% and Donald Trump at 44%. Ipsos, however, maintained that a nip and tuck affair weighted the US with Biden at 39% and Donald Trump at 40%. And as suggested by polls, with Biden at the helm of Democrats are staring at a complete wipeout. To prevent that, the heavyweights, including former President Barack Obama, have privately conveyed to Joe Biden that he needs to reflect on his candidacy. A recent survey shows that 67% Democrats want Biden to withdraw from the race and allow his party to select a different nominee for this November. The survey conducted between July 11th and 15th shows that Biden faces resistance from his own party, with only 35% of the Democrats saying that he should stay in the race. Now the question arises, if Biden bows to the mounting pressure and ends his re-election bid, who would be his replacement? Nearly four in five Democrats say that they would vouch for incumbent Vice President Kamala Harris. An economist YouGov poll found that 79% of Democrats would favor the change in party's presidential nominee. The Democrats, however, lacked consensus on whether Harris would fare better than Biden against Donald Trump. And that is the ultimate goal. 28% said that Harris would be more likely than Biden to defeat Trump. 24% said that she would be less likely, while 32% said that she would have about the same odds. Those are the figures we are getting. The latest coming in from the opinion polls. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.